Marching troops, gleaming missiles, and thundering jets. What do the world's biggest military parades reveal about global power dynamics? Today, folks, our lens isn't zeroed in on the nuts and bolts of military might. Nope, we're turning our attention to the sheer spectacle of military parades, a blend of power, pride, and pageantry. Every year, countries coast to coast pull out all the stops, hosting grand parades to honor the anniversaries of their armed forces or to tip their hats to their days of independence. Now the question is, which nations really light up the big board with their military parades on the global scene? Well, buckle up. We're about to jump into that very topic in the upcoming video. All right, let's hit the ground running with North Korea's parade playbook. Now this nation, too many, might come off as the recluse on the block, especially when stacked up against its more modern cousin to the South, South Korea. But don't let that fool you. When it comes to flexing military muscle, North Korea ain't just swinging, they're hitting home runs. To paint you a picture, GlobalFirepower.com pins them at a commendable 34th spot in the world's military power rankings. Now, under the watch of none other than Kim Jong-un, North Korea pulled out the big guns, quite literally, with a massive parade celebrating the Korean War armistice inked between 1950 to 1953. They call it Victory Day and circled July 27th, 2023 on their calendars for it. The curveball here? They unveiled their brand new toy, the solid-fueled Hwasong-18, an intercontinental ballistic missile, ICBM. This bad boy with its crosshair on global targets comes packed with a nuclear punch. And hey, flashback to last February. North Korea threw a parade that was nothing short of a blockbuster, marking 75 years of their armed forces. We're talking thousands of troops marching, weapons galore, and a missile showcase that'd make any military buff's eyes pop. Held in the heart of Pyongyang, the parade had its fair share of VIPs, including Kim Jong-un and his daughter, who, let me tell you, knows how to steal a scene. Now, a key takeaway. This parade had North Korea rolling out more ICBMs than we've ever seen. It's like a loud and clear announcement of their nuclear strike game, even flaunting tactical nuclear units. The kind of arsenal they put on display? Well, word on the street is, it could give the US missile defense system a serious run for its money. And that, my friends, is something we can't just whistle past. One more tidbit for ya. Since Kim Jong-un stepped up after his old man's exit in 2011, North Korea's held, get this, 14 military parades in just 12 years. Talk about a penchant for showing off some military razzle-dazzle. Now, folks, when we're chatting about top-tier military parades, China ain't just playing ball, they're slam-dunking in style. Heck, if I had to rank them, I'd say they're right up there with the big dogs in the parade game. You remember that jaw-dropping spectacle in 2019, right? The 70th blowout bash? marking the birth of the People's Republic of China? Talk about a showstopper. Hands down, it was the grandest military showcase since the days Mao Zedong was calling the shots. Picture this, Tiananmen Square, Beijing, with China strutting out their latest and greatest in military tech for the first time ever. A whopping 15,000 troops, a staggering 580 pieces of military hardware, and a sky full of around 160 fighter jets painting the horizon. And if we're spotlighting highlights, that stealth fighter J-20A? Sheesh. Many say it's toe-to-toe -to -toe with Uncle Sam's very own F-22. And don't get me started on the heavyweight bomber crew. The H-6 series, including the H-6K and H-6N, plus the HU-6 refueling Big Bird. But if there's one thing that truly had cameras flashing, it's the grand reveal of missiles like the DF-17, DF-100, and the Big Kahuna DF-41. Little fun fact, the DF-17 is hyped up as a hypersonic missile that might just give U.S. defenses a real headache. And hey, ground troops got their moment too. Showcasing the Type 19 rifles, these bad boys made quite a statement. But the crown jewel? The Hongdu GJ-11 sharp sword drone, stealthy, slick, and armed to the teeth with guided missiles and bombs. Now, shifting gears to Mother Russia, they ain't ones to shy away from a military spectacle, no sir.
Every darn year, Russia rolls out the red carpet, celebrating their historic win against Nazi Germany in WW2. But this year? Oh boy, they threw us a curveball. Among all the hardware, just one old-school T-34 tank from the WW2 days made its cameo and get this, hitching a ride on a truck. The sight of this solo tank? Well, it was like watching a classic car in a modern auto show. Pure nostalgia. And in a surprising twist, no roaring engines of planes or choppers echoed through the skies, a stark contrast to their usual parade playbook. Now, between you and me, the Russian bigwigs were tight-lipped about the whole low-key armor show. But if you read between the lines and listened to the buzz, many reckon it's a not-so-subtle nod to the hardships the Russian army faced during their unexpected dance with Ukraine. Hold on to your hats, folks. Let's zero in on a nation that's been on Uncle Sam's radar for a hot minute. Iran. You might be surprised to know they're packing some serious heat, securing the 17th rank on the global military power scoreboard. On April 18, 2023, Tehran, Iran's heartbeat, became the epicenter of a show-stopping military parade, marking their military day with a bang. The parade spread? Think missiles that could raise eyebrows, tanks that'd make you look twice, and an ensemble of armored vehicles, firearms, UAVs, radar, and air defense systems. Now to drop some numbers on you, Iran boasts 4,081 tanks, a mind-boggling 69,685 armored vehicles, 2,630 tank launchers, and 1,085 rocket launchers. And the skies? They ain't left out either. The parade had over 40 fighter jets soaring high, including some heavy hitters like the Saike, Kausar, and the classic F-14s, MiG-29S, and Sukhois. They were flexing their aerial muscles and showing off some impressive acrobatics. Crunch those figures, and Iran's sporting a Sky Armada of 760 fighter jets, 196 support aircraft, and 138 choppers. But here's the kicker. This parade? Just the tip of their military iceberg. All right, buckle up because things get a tad unconventional with Afghanistan, especially after the Taliban played their hand. Picture this, rows of fighters donning traditional white tunics, decked out with khaki combat vests, and headgear inscribed with the Muslim Declaration of Faith. It's a whole new ballgame. Here's a quick flashback for you. Before the Taliban came back into the spotlight, back in April 2021, Afghanistan's military muscle was around 307,000 strong. That's the Army, Special Ops, Air Force, Police, and the Sleuths. Then, enter the Taliban, and the game board shifted. While getting an exact head count of the Taliban ain't easy, the folks at the UN Security Council monitor ballpark, it between 55,000 to 85,000 in 2020. Their military parade? Oh boy, it's got its own signature style. While they might have showcased only a handful of aircraft, here's the twist. They've got their mitts on the gear once flaunted by the Afghan Air Force. Yep, we're talking 43 MD-530 helicopters, 33 C-208S, Black Hawk UH-60S, My-17 choppers, and even the big league Hercules C-130S. All these sky giants? Now under the Taliban's banner. There you have it, folks. A flyby of some of the most striking military parades around the globe. From the regimented masses of China's troops to Russia's rare showcase of aged armor, these events offer a unique window into each nation's power dynamics and military philosophies. While viewing these parades can be quite a spectacle, we mustn't lose sight of their greater significance. At their core, they are demonstrations of might and pride, but also reminders of sacrifice and warnings to potential foes. Whatever each parade's particular message, one thing's for sure, they'll continue gripping the world's attention for years to come. That wraps up our military parade worldwide tour for today. Stay tuned for our next video.